Everybody knows about a snow flap. Mud flap, snow flap. You gotta have a snow flap on a snowmobile, especially when going up the trail. Why? Keeps it cool, keeps snow on the sliders, so you don't wear things out. So yeah, when you got snow coming off the track, it hits the snow flap, and then keeps snow in the track, keeps it up, sprays it up on the coolers, and then eventually falls down onto the sliders. So sliders, plastic on steel, what keeps it cool? Snow, obviously snow, right? Bad thing about the new cats is there's no cooler. They got a very small cooler up front. Um, the new Dews and Polaris's and Yamahas all have a big cooler, which helps keep the sled cool. Um, Dew came out with a nice, uh, a nice removable flap last year. It's awesome, it's just a couple twist ties. Or a couple clamps, I don't know what they call it, Q-Link, whatever. Comes off, it's slick, I like it. So, I'm looking at mine going, you know, it's kind of a pain in the arse. Um, you got the snow flap, works great up the trail. Oh, what was that? Mosquito. Ooh. Here we are, guys. It's subscribe time. You gotta subscribe. When you're up in the mountain, these, bad, these cats have a really bad bumper. You can't get your hands in here to get yourself unstuck. When you're stuck, this thing's hitting you in the legs or it's bent out like this because they're shit, right? So what I did, I'm going to show you a quick little trip to do on a cat. Polaris's are different. Uh, Skidoo's are different. So on a cat, if you take a look, all I did was drilled out the rivets on your snow flap. There's two here. There's two up underneath this thing. And there's four here, right on the tunnel. I drilled them out, went to Homey Depot, picked up some carriage bolts and a couple uh, plastic uh, knobs, and I stuck it on here. So today I'm looking at it going, you know, where can I store this thing? Usually what I did was I took it off. So what I do, you watch this, how easy this is. I take this thing off, take the knobs off. Push out the carriage bolts. Nice and simple. I mean, yeah, it takes a little bit of time. It's not like a quick little clamp thingy or whatever, but. So there, boom. Slow flaps off. How long did that take? 30 seconds, maybe. So I'm looking today going, hey, instead of putting it on my bag, and strapping it down with straps. Let's just put it here. And we'll tie it on. I mean, there's no cooler anyways. So what the heck? So right now, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take a 3 drill bit. I'm gonna drill out these rivets. Bada boom, bada bing. Takes two seconds. These tunnels are shit anyways. Ouch, that's hot. We're going to drill a quarter inch hole. We're going to take a nice little, whoops, three angled file. You guys can see that. Everybody kind of got one of these little babies kicking around. We're going to take it. We're gonna make a four corner hole for the carriage bolt. Man, these tunnels are weak, wow. Beauty. So let's take this carriage bolt. Ooh, that looks pretty good. So now we're gonna take our two short carriage bolts that we got with that flap. Awesome, they fit good. 
We're going to take our snow flap, tuck it underneath my bag. We're going to put this bolt up through there. I can't believe how easy this just turned out. Carriage bolt number one. Carriage bolt number two. Woo! That's awesome. Check it out, guys. Snow flap is gone. So now, when you're in the deep, deep snow, we're in like two or three feet of pow, which we get here in Sycamus quite a bit. This snow doesn't get held up in the suspension in the deep snow. So now it can go out the back, you can go a little faster, you can do your little rear entry things or butterflies or whatever you got, got going on there with ease. Great little mod. Check it out, you guys can do it. I know you can do it. Girls and boys, thanks for coming to class. Stick around.